Hey, what's up everybody? True Boxing here. Thank you for coming back to get hit with the truth. So today we're doing the zone preview for Saturday, March 16th, as we're gonna as it's headlined by William Zapata and Maxi Hughes as they will battle in a double final eliminator. Now, before we get into that, if you could smash the like button, leave a comment, or subscribe to the channel, I really do appreciate any and all support that I can get as I continue to build my channel here. So this fight, um, well, first we're going to discuss uh, one fight on the undercard, the co-feature. Floyd Schofield, undefeated lightweight contender, uh, returns and just staying busy. Um, I didn't even remember the name of the guy he's fighting because it's uh, it should be a, a good, you know, just a good performance for him as he stays busy, as, he, as long as he doesn't overlook his opponent. But he's uh, fighting in the co-feature, but the main event, is a double lightweight final eliminator. What does that mean? That means the WBA and the IBF have deemed this a final eliminator right here between William Zapata and Maxi Hughes. Um, it's a it's a big fight for that purpose, but it, it makes you wonder what is on the horizon. And the reason I ask that is you have Tank Davis could be fighting Frank Martin in June. Uh, there's a lot of talk about him fighting Frank Martin defending the WBA lightweight title. And then, you know, we got Vasily Lomachenko battling George Cambosos Jr. Um, for the vacant IBF title in May. And so the winner of this fight, Zapata and Hughes, is uh, in line to fight either of those winners. And those are probably the two biggest names in the division outside of Shakur Stevenson um, in terms of Tank Davis and... Uh, Vasily Lomachenko. So, will the winner of this fight wait around for a unification bout between potentially Tank and Loma, the two favorites going into their uh, their eliminators? Will that happen and set up Zapata versus the the next unified champ, or will Zapata get an opportunity to fight uh, one of these two fighters? Just period, or the winner of Zapata and Hughes? So. That's what's circling this fight. That's what's making this such a big time fight. And you look at the two competitors, William Zapata, um, undefeated, great knockout ratio. He's coming off of um, the last two years, he scored the biggest wins of his career, beating former champs Rene Alvarado and Joseph Diaz Jr. in 2022 by decisions. And then he bounced back with knockouts last year over uh, Jaime Arboleda and, um, and veteran Mercito Gesta. Um, you know, and now he is in line to fight Maxi Hughes, who last year fought his ass off against um, George Cambosos Jr. in the IBF final eliminator and came up with uh, a tough majority decision loss, somewhat controversial to a lot of people. And that, um, you know, has put him in this position to challenge um, William Zapata, but Maxi Hughes. A different resume. He's like 26 and six. You know, he's he's one of those. Uh, he he was one of those kind of British, more local type guys that just fight. They all fight each other. They chalk up losses every now and then. And over the years, you know, he's done that. But he's fought well recently. Um, victory over Kid Galahad, and then last year that uh, I, I think that was in 2022, and then last year that strong performance against former unified champ George Cambosos Jr. So Maxi Hughes, this is his time. Uh, you know, he's not going to find a better time to move in line for a world title. And William Zapata as well. I mean, he's the favorite coming in. He's the guy that's hot. He throws a bunch of punches, packs a good punch. Um, younger, can he pull this fight out against uh, Maxi Hughes? And to be honest, he, he has to look good in this fight too in order to be believable as a as a legitimate uh, lightweight contender, you know, and the future of the division. So I'm really looking forward to this main event. I think it's going to be good on Saturday night. I'm picking William Zapata to win this fight by a stoppage in the middle to potentially later rounds. And I think he's, again, I think he's going to retain his, um, his uh, world. Uh, or, I mean, I think he's going to put himself in line for the world title uh, in either division and hopefully get a crack at, at a champion later in the year. Unless, as I said, 
uh, Tank Davis and Vasily Lomachenko are the ones that come out of those two title fights as champ, and they decide to fight each other, then William Zapata has it locked up at least for the big, for early next year to be challenging the winner of that fight. So, which would be huge. So we'll see. You know, um, we'll see what happens uh, this weekend. Uh, but I do believe Maxi Hughes is a live underdog, but I just think uh, he's he's out of his depth right here, and I think um, William Zapata is going to shine in this one and get the TKO win. So that's it. That's what I got. That's my Zapata versus Hughes DAZN preview and prediction that's taking place Saturday, March 16th on DAZN. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, smash the like button, leave a comment, or subscribe to the channel. I appreciate any and all support. This is True Boxing. You've been hit with the truth.